My name is Ryan. This is a Alco 262 steam locomotive. This is a prairie type. The, uh, the locomotive was built for the McLeod River Railroad. It was, a, it was a logging railroad in McLeod, California. It was built in 1925 and uh, has been in service basically since then. There were uh, periods of time where it was in storage and, and waiting restoration. But uh, we, we started operating it in 2012. Two six two is uh, means there's two pilot wheels. There's six driving wheels and two trailing wheels. To operate a steam locomotive, there are two two main crew members. There's a person on the left called the fireman. The fireman controls the boiler, while the person on the right is the engineer. Engineer controls the the train. It controls the speed and and starting and stopping the train. And the fire uh, generates steam for the steam locomotive to, to pro be propelled down the road. And uh, the main control for the steam is this brass handle. This is a uh, this is an oil control valve. The oil control valve controls the amount of oil that's being led into the firebox to be burned. The handle below is a damper that, that controls the amount of air that is being allowed into the firebox. And these valves up here are different accessory controls that control the, the behavior of the fire. This valve here is a an atomizer that controls the amount of atomization that the oil is uh, subjected to. Different throttle positions. <clears throat> uh, required small adjustments to uh, improve the efficiency. This valve here is a artificial draft that controls the uh, a jet of steam that assists the boiler in drawing smoke and fire through the boiler. To add bo water to the boiler, use what's called an injector. And this is an injector on the left hand side. Injector uses steam power to push water into the boiler and that gauge here is what's called a, a water sight glass. You can see the level of water in the sight glass. Right now we're about half of a glass and the steam pressure gauge is in the top center. Currently we're sitting at about 175 psi pressure. So in here we've got fire. This is this is the uh, the firebox into the boiler. Uh, then to the right is where the engineer sits. The engineer is in charge of operating the steam engine and the train. Uh, the this bar here is the throttle. It controls the speed of the engine. These handles here are the brakes. This is the train brake. It controls the uh, the brakes on the on the cars themselves, while this handle is the engine brake. It controls the brakes on the locomotive itself. The handle here, this controls the valve linkage for the, for the steam engine itself, and it controls, it makes the engine go in reverse. Or in forward. That is how the engineer drives the engine. It's a lot of seat of the pants just experience. It's it's all about connecting the feel of the train to what what needs to happen with the throttle or with the brake. 